Enums and ROS. How different are they compared to C enums? How to properly use them, and as a bonus, how to implement Rust enums in C. Well, first let's divide Rust enums into two categories, conventions and logic. Enums can essentially be imitated with constants. This is first of all convenient, because you won't accidentally misspell the name, and second of all is good for performance, because comparing enums is much faster than any other types. But we could also make an enum, and get the equivalent of this program. This version better suits the conventions. By the way, if you see someone using strings to imitate enums, keep in mind how they compared. It goes over the first string, while well, a string is just a sequence of characters, and makes sure the character of the index in the second string is the same, so it's unbelievably slow. Obviously, we could make it faster by first making sure the length is the same, because otherwise they aren't equal anyway, but it'll make it faster only if the lengths are all different. Let's say we need to have a list of instructions. The first one is to print a string and a string itself within the brackets after the variant. Then to print a number and the number itself and to exit the program. Now let's make a list of instructions and go through it. Then we need to match case the current instruction. If it's print string, we pull out the string itself and print it out. And the same for printing the number. For exit, we don't have any additional values. So there is nothing to pull out and we just exit the program. This code isn't just convenient, because it's one of the ways to implement the logic. Keep in mind, we could use regular if statements if we, for example, only cared about one case. Now let's switch to C and see how we can implement that program with instructions. As you can notice, Rust enums are essentially a combination of unions and enums in C. So let's make a structure and call it instruction. It has two fields, the first one containing one of these. For that, we can use a union. And for the second one, we need to know the type of an instruction instance, basically one of these. And then we do the rest. When you store references in enums, Rust wants you to explicitly define the lifetimes. Now let's discuss alignment. Memory alignment ensures that data types start at specific memory addresses that are multiples to their size. Aligned data allows the CPU to access data in fewer steps and is generally better to work with for the CPU. Here U8 takes up 1 byte, and U32 takes up 4. Well, how much does the struct take up? Well, U8 gets aligned to take up 4 bytes. Well, not per se, but petting data is added for this chunk. So it takes up 8. And the same for enums. 